Welcome to Nationals Park. The show has an NL East matchup. It's the Philadelphia Phillies and the Washington Nationals. That you could handle. That one hammered center field. Way back. Go! Juan Soto goes deep. The Nationals strike first. It's 1-0. Pitch. Drilled in the air. Right field. Way back there. And that is out of here. His second of the year. And just like that, they're out front. It's 3-1. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. That's back there. And it is gone. Bryce Harper goes deep. Third home run of the season. And they throw a pair on the board. It's 5-1. That one ripped. This one's got a chance. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. A solo shot, and they're chipping away. It's 5-2. Pitch. Swung on, belted. That's back there. And it's gone! Home run! That one felt good. Third home run of the season. It's 6-2. Here's a drive out to right center. Way back there. Look out! Gone! He sends it out of here. Third home run of the season, and they throw three on the board. It's 7-5. 1-1. Now a rocket to right center. Way back there, and forget it. It's out of here. He muscles that one out the opposite way. That's his 99th career homer, and they add to their lead. It's 8-5. The show brings you a matchup of division rivals. It's the St. Louis Cardinals and the Chicago Cubs. That one hammered center field. That's back there. Into the bleachers and gone. Jan Gomes takes him deep. And this game is tied. It's 1-1. Yesterday afternoon with three homers. Swung on, belted. Way back there. And it's into the bleachers, out of here. A soaring shot to center. His fourth home run of the season. It's 2-1. And that one lifted in the air, center field. Back there. Into the shrubbery and out of here. Frank Schwindel goes deep. Third home run of the season. And they tack on to their lead. It's 6-1. Oh, now this is blasted way back there on its way gone a three-run homer his second of the year and they inch closer it's six four as they'd have to think about it from your infielders have to think about that oh now this one's high and deep way back there on its way gone he sends it out of here Third home run of the season. It's 6 5. And now this one's a rocket to right. Way back there. Gone. Paul Goldschmidt goes deep. Third home run of the season. It's 7 6. Getting loose as well. Oh, now this one's blasted deep to left. Way back there. On its way and out of here. Jan Gomes hits one out, and we're level. It's 7-7. Drill to center. That's way back, and you can't forget it. Home run. His second home run of the game, and that gives him a lead. It's 9-7. He's making his fourth appearance of the season. And here is Nelson Velasquez. That one is back. And gone into the home run basket. He flexes his power with that swing, his second of the year, and they add on. It's 
Bucks. 2-2. Two -two. That one is absolutely belted. Back there. And that ball is out of here. He'll touch them all. And they're chipping away. It's 10-8. Now a blast to left center, way back there, on its way, out of here. Tyler O'Neill sends it out. It's his sixth home run of the season. It's 10-9. Oh, now this is drilled to center, way back there, on its way, and gone. He circles the bases, his fourth home run of the season. It's 11-9 to two. Fly ball, pretty well struck right field. That one carrying, and out of here. The big blow to the home fans. He's done it again. His second homer of the game, and they close the gap. It's 11-10. The right-hander deals. That one ripped. That's back there. Gone! That'll fire up the dugout. And the show brings you a matchup of division rivals. It's the Chicago White Sox going up against the Kansas City Royals. Garcia up to the plate. And that one hammered way back. That one is gone. His seventh home run of the season. And it gives him the lead in the first. It's 2-0. The pitch. Oh, this ball is crushed into left field. It's on its way and gone. Jose Abreu goes deep. It's his sixth home run of the season. And they add to the lead. It's 3-0. The pitch. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. That one on its way. Off the batter's eye and gone. He made him pay for that one. And they throw a pair on the board. It's five zip. Right on top of it. They hand the ball over to. Oh, this one high and deep. Way back there. Gone. Aloy Jimenez leaves the yard. His second of the year, and they add a couple more. It's 7 0. 32 now. Swung on, belted. That's back. And that one's gone. Salvador Perez the opposite way, and they close the gap. It's 7 1. Left hand hitter waits. That one is absolutely belted. That's back. Off the batter's eye and gone. That one felt good, and they slice into the lead. It's 7-2. And attacking that baseball. And now here is Edward Olivares. Oh, now this one's blasted deep to left. Way back there, on its way, and out of here. Another one. Back-to-back -back homers, his first homer of the year, and they inch closer. It's 7-3. In the air, right field, pretty well struck. Back there. Out of here. He flexes his power with that swing, and they add a run. It's 8-3. And next to hit for the Sox, Luis Robert. Swing and a ball hammered left field. And it's gone. Home run. Luis Robert hits one out. And they add to their lead. It's 11-3. Here comes a pitch. Here's a swing and a drive left field. And he knew it. Salvador Perez leaves the yard, and they throw three on the board. It's 11 6. It's a 1 2. That one ripped. Way back there. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. His second of the year, and they add a run. It's 12 6. 
Here's a sling and a drive left field, and he knew it. His first homer in the majors, and they're going to have to send somebody to get that ball for him. Always such a special moment. You know this is one of the biggest thrills of his life. He's got to be floating around the bases right now. Yeah, he'll remember every detail of that at bat for years, as he should. It's a true once-in-a-lifetime event. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there, on its way. Gone. He sends a rocket to left, and they tack on to their lead. It's 13-9. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there, on its way, gone. Hunter Dozier leaves the park. His first homer of the year, it's 13-10. Chicago, Jose Abreu. He's already homered in this game. Now this one is smoked down the left field line. On its way, it's fair. Out of here. Another homer. His second home run of the game. And they add on. It's 14-10. And welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. Interleague Baseball on MLB The Show. It's the Texas Rangers taking on the Miami Marlins. And a 3-2. Oh, now this is blasted way back there on its way. Gone. Marcus Simeon goes deep, and that gives him a lead. It's 1 0. It's 2 1. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there on its way. Gone. Home run number five on the season, and they throw three on the board. It's 3 1 pitch oh now this one's blasted deep to left way back there on its way and out of here he'll touch them all and they add a run it's 4-1 your swing he stayed on it and got all of it oh and now this one's crushed this one's on its way and gone Jorge Soler goes deep. His ninth homer of the year, and they add on. It's 5-1. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there, on its way. Gone. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. And they tack on to their lead. It's 6-2. 2-2 down. Well struck right field. And that one's gone. He circles the bases. Home run number five on the season. And they add to their lead. It's 7-2. Up and throwing. Now a blast to left center. Way back there. On its way. Out of here. Peyton Henry with his first major league home run. A special moment in his young career. And who knows, maybe that'll open the floodgates for him. Yeah, getting that out of the way can be a big confidence booster. It feels like a huge weight just been taken off your back. You can go up there with a lot less pressure on you now. And I wouldn't be surprised if he gets hot for a little while. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Corey Seager goes deep. Third home run of the season, and they close the gap. It's 8-3. That one is absolutely belted. Way back there. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. Nathaniel Lowe goes deep. His second of the year. It's 8-4. Result every time. Here is Marcus Simeon. That one ripped. And gone! He sends a rocket to left. His fourth home run of the season. And they cut into the lead. It's 8-6. And welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. The show brings you a matchup of division rivals. It's the Pittsburgh Pirates going up against the Cincinnati Reds. John Sh there on the ball. Should be fun to watch and see how it plays out. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there. On its way. Gone. 
He powers one out to right field, and just like that, they're out front. It's 2 nothing. Her eye, I'm taking a little bit more off, see if you can get him to chase something in the dirt. That one ripped. That's back there. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. A soaring shot to center. It's his sixth home run of the season, and they tack on to their lead. It's 3-0. Three runs, but put something up. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Joey Votto bops one out of here. And they throw a pair on the board. It's 3-2. The pitch. Oh, this is deep to left center. Way back there. On its way. Gone. His second of the year, and we're level. It's 3-3. Cal Farmer up to the plate now. This one blasted deep to left. Way out of here. Home run. They're going crazy in the dugout. Home run number five on the season, and they jump out front. It's 4-3. Swung on, belted. Way back there. And it is gone! That'll fire up the dugout. His second home run of the game, it's 5-4. They went a long way. Roberto Perez standing in. Oh, this ball is crushed into left field. It's on its way and gone! Roberto Perez bops one out of here. Yeah. Hit well, right field, way back, and gone. Brian Reynolds leaves the yard. That's his 50th career homer. And they add to the lead. It's 8-4. Swing over the top. That one is absolutely belted. That's bad. And forget it. He circles the bases. Third home run of the season. It's 10-4. The 1-1. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. His fourth home run of the season, and they cut into the lead. It's 10-5. Swings and crushes one right field, way back, and gone. Moustakis goes deep. Third home run of the season, and they close the gap. It's 10 6. He swings and drives one out to deep left field on its way. And that one's gone. His second of the year, and they cut into the deficit. It's 10 7. Swing and a ball lifted in the air. Left field, pretty well struck. Way back there. Gone! A shot to left. His second of the year. It's 10-8. The tying run at the plate. Oh, now this one's blasted deep to left. Way back there. On its way and out of here. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. And they add a pair. It's 10-10. This one is smashed down the right field line. Way back there. Fair and gone. His second home run of the game, and they jump in front in the ninth. It's 11-10. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Daniel Vogelback leaves the yard. It's his eighth home run of the year, and they add a run. It's 12-10. Stepping in, O'Neill Cruz. Oh, now this one is blasted to right. Forget it. Way back there and gone. He sends it out of here. That's his third home run of the game, and they boost their lead. It's 13-10. Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. The show has an AL East matchup. It's the Baltimore Orioles and the Boston Red Sox. 
This ball is hammered deep center field. Way back there. On its way. Out of here. That was a moonshot. His second of the year. And they grab the lead. It's 1-0. The pitch. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. A solo shot. His first homer of the year. Just like that, they move in front. It's 2-1. Oh, this is deep to left center. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Ryan Mountcastle hits one out. His first homer of the year. And they tack on three. It's 5-1. If you fly open with the fresh shoulder, there's no way you keep that ball. Now this ball is well hit. This one's got a chance. And out of here. Trey Mancini blasts one out the opposite way. And they tack on to their lead. It's 6-1. That one. This one is smashed down the right field line. Way back there. Fair and gone. Rafael Devers rounds the bases. His fourth home run of the season. And they inch closer. It's 6-2. The wind and the pitch. That one is blasted. Left field towards the monster. Into the monster seats and gone. His second of the year. And they add on. It's 7-2. Finish well off the plate. Swings and blasts one deep to left center. Way back there. And it's over the monster and off the billboard. His first homer of the year, and they add a run. It's 8-2. You, you're right where you want to be with your swing mechanics. That one ripped. That's back there. And out of here. He deposits that one into the monster seats. Kike Hernandez takes him deep. His first homer of the year, and they're chipping away. It's 10-4. And that one hammered on its way. And it's out of here. Trey Mancini goes deep. Third home run of the season, and they add to their lead. It's 11-4. Oh, now this one's blasted deep to left. Way back there, on its way, and out of here. J.D. Martinez takes him deep. Third home run of the season. It's 11-6. And a pitch. Swang and a high fly ball in the air, left field. Back there. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. A two-run homer, his first homer of the year, and they throw a pair on the board. It's 11-8. The break guys snap off these days is just dead. Oh, this one high and deep. Way back there. And it's gone. He crushes that one to center field, and they add to the lead. It's 13-8. Left field, it was extra bases all the way. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there, on its way, gone. The two-run shot, and they add a couple more. It's 15-8. Thing broke down as well, and that's what caused him to pop it up. This one drilled to left. No doubt about it as they add on more. Gone. A towering home run. Welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. MLB The Show has action out of the AL Central. It's the Minnesota Twins taking on the Cleveland Guardians. That one is absolutely belted. Back there. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. Home run number five on the season, and the Twins get on the board first. It's 1-0. That one's on its way. No question about it, and that one will go. Carlos Correa will circle the bags. His first homer of the year, and they tack on to their lead. It's 2-0. It jumped off his back. Kind of put it all together. 
ball. This one high and deep. Way back there. And that one is out of here. Byron Buxton goes the opposite way. His first homer of the year, it's five zip. I think that if they gave the pitcher a full scouting report on me, yes, I think I could draw a walk. That one back there, leaping, and it's gone. So he just clears the wall, his second home run of the game, and they add to their lead. It's seven nothing. Billy follow. Gary Sanchez, he is a guy that hits the ball hard. Clearly he was geared up for the fastball right there. Maybe got student. This one drilled to left. No doubt about it as they add on more. Gone. Byron Buxton blasts one out. His second of the year, it's 8-0. Great angle to the ball and just had enough closing speed in the tank after that long run to make the catch. <laughs> it's a wild ride, but a lot of fun to watch. Out of here! Jorge Polanco goes deep, his second of the year, and they add to the lead. It's 9-0. The wind and the pitch. And that one hammered way back there. Gone! He'll touch them all. That's his third home run of the game. It's 10-0. There's a swing and a drive. And that one's gone. Jose Ramirez bops one out. His second of the year, and they cut into the lead. It's 10-1. Just a little bit. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there, on its way, gone! He'll circle the bases, his first homer of the year, it's 10-5. Trailing by a bunch, so he'll try to keep it where it is. Call at this point of the ball. Here's a swing and a drive, left field, and he knew it. Home run of the season, it's 11-5. Kicks and fires. Swing and a ball hammered left field. That one back. And forget it. He powers that one out to left. His first homer of the year. And they inch closer. It's 11 6. Drilled out towards left center field. That's well struck. Way back there. That one is gone. A shot to the opposite field, and they add on. It's 12-7. As a pitcher, it really allows you to start expanding. This one swung on and hit well. Way back there. And that ball is gone. Third home run of the season, and they add a run. It's 13-7. From inside Rogers Center in downtown Toronto, the show has an AL East matchup. It's the Tampa Bay Rays and the Toronto Blue Jays. East. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Brandon Lau bops one out of here. Third home run of the season. And just like that, they're out front. It's 2 nothing. What? Very difficult to do anything with that. That one ripped. And out of here. An absolute blast to left. And they add to the lead. It's 3-0. The pitch. Well struck left field. That one back. And it's gone. Home run. Matt Chapman hits one out. His first homer of the year. It's 3-2. Junior. That one blasted deep to right. Back there. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. Lourdes Goriel Jr. goes yard. His second of the year, and they close the gap. It's 10 3. Now a blast to left center. Way back there. On its way. Out of here. Yeah. 
Chapman bops one out of here. His second home run of the game. It's 10-4. There's a swing and a drive. And that one is out of here. That'll fire up the dugout, and they cut into the lead. It's 10-5. And there's a fly ball, deep right field, way back there. And gone! Vladdy blasts one out the opposite way. And they cut into the deficit. It's 10-6. Oh, this is deep to left center, way back there, on its way, gone! Brandon Lau goes the other way with it. That's his third home run of the game. And they add a pair. It's 12 8. Defensive, and all of a sudden, for the hitter, that play. This one swung on and hit well. Way back there. And it's gone. A shot to left. His first homer of the year. It's 13 8. He deals. That one ripped. And that ball is gone. G-Man Choi bops one out of here. Third home run of the season. And they add a run. It's 14-8. The 1-1. And that one hammered. That's back. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. His fourth home run of the season. And they tack on to their lead. It's 16 to 8. In for the Rays, Kevin Kiermeyer. Swung on, belted. Back there. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. And they add to their lead. It's 17 to 8. He swings and drives one out to deep left field. And that ball is out of here. Teoscar Hernandez hits one out. His second of the year. And they slice into the lead. It's 17 to 9. This one is smashed down the right field line. Way back there. Fair and gone. A two-run shot, his second home run of the game, and they're chipping away. It's 17 to 11. Baseball from the Lone Star State. MLB the show with a good one coming at you. It's the New York Yankees taking on the Houston Astros. Swing and a ball lifted in the air, left field, pretty well struck. That's bad. Gone! Kyle Tucker sent it out. His fourth home run of the season. And it gives him the lead in the first. It's 1-0. Yuli Gurriel comes up to hit. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there. On its way. Gone! Yuli Gurriel bops one out of here third home run of the season and they add to the lead it's 2-0 Alvarez and there's a fly ball deep right field and it's out of here Jordan Alvarez circles the bases third home run of the season it's 3-0 this was basketball that opposing team would call it Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Jose Altuve will touch them all. His fourth home run of the season. And they add a run. It's 4-0. Now this one is smoked down the left field line. On its way. If it's fair, out of here. Alex Bregman sends it out. His seventh home run of the season. And they boost their lead. It's five zip. And crushed to right. And that one's going to lead the park. Out of here. Home run. His first homer of the year. And they throw a pair on the board. It's seven nothing. They were Torres up to the plate. Swing and a ball hammered left field. That one is gone. 
Glaber Torres goes yard. Home run number five on the season, and they close the gap. It's 7-2. Done. That one hammered left field. And out of here. Fielder Aaron Judge. This guy is one of the best athletes in the sport. Now a blast to left center. Way back there. On its way. Out of here. Aaron Judge leads the yard. His fourth home run of the season. And they inch closer. It's 8-3. Right where it is. So at this point of the ball game. Oh, this one high and deep. Way back there. And it's gone. Home run. Anthony Rizzo circles the bases. And they tack on three. It's 8-6. Ball game. Here comes Glaber Torres. That one is absolutely belted. And that is gone. It's his sixth home run of the season, and they slice into the lead. It's 8-7. And yeah, the right-hander deals. That one hammered center field. That ball's carrying. Out of here! A solo shot, and we are starting over. It's 8-8. The pitch. This one squared up down the left field line. If it's fair, it's gone. It's fair, and it is gone. That's what the fans came to see, and the Astros jump in front. It's 9-8. Just a little tardy on the fastball. This ball is hammered. Deep center field. Way back there. On its way. Out of here. Jordan Alvarez blasts one out. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. It's 10-8. Here's a 1-1. Oh, this ball is crushed into left field. It's on its way and gone. His second of the year, and they add on. It's 11-8. That slider, when a guy's able to really... Now, this ball is well hit. This one's got a chance. And out of here. John Carlos Stanton goes deep, and they cut into the deficit. It's 11 9. Welcome from the home of the New York Mets, City Field in Queens. The show has an NL East matchup. The Atlanta Braves going up against the New York Mets. Uh, uncertainty for opposing teams, especially in a big game, big series. Oh, now this one is blasted to right. Moore, get it. Way back there and gone. He flexes his power with that swing. His fourth home run of the season. It's 1-0. Beat stuff. Tend to have some pretty good success with him back there. Now this ball is well hit. This one's got a chance. And that one is off the batter's eye. Wow, out of here. This place is absolutely loving it. A four spot on the board. It's five zip. JD. David. That one hammered center field. That's back there. And that ball is out of here. JD Davis leaves the yard. Third home run of the season. And they add on. It's six nothing. Years old. And he is one of the great talent. This one swung on and hit well. Way back there. And that one is out of here. A shot to the opposite field. His seventh home run of the season. It's 6-1. At the opposite way, out of the ballpark. You want to buy. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Matt Olson goes deep. Home run number five on the season, and they cut into the lead. It's 6-2. They got to be ready to hit if you're in the box. Swung on, belted. That one back. Off the batter's eye and gone. Adam Duvall blasts one out. His fourth home run of the season. It's 6-3. Ozzy Albies. This guy has turned into a beast. 
Now a rocket to right center. Way back there. And forget it. It's out of here. Ozzy Albies goes yard. Home run number five on the season, and they inch closer. It's 6-4. That's the one thing we're seeing, that high fastball. You have to get it up. Oh, this one high and deep. Way back there. It's gone. Dansby Swanson hits one out. His second of the year, and they close the gap. It's 6-5. Oh, now this one's blasted deep to left. Way back there, on its way, and out of here. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. And we are starting over. It's 6-6. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there, on its way. Gone. Pete Alonso takes it deep. His second of the year, it's 7-6. They are doing some special things with it. That one ripped. That's back there. Turning and looking, and it's gone. He made him pay for that one. Third home run of the season, it's 7-7. In the air, left side. And that is gone. Dansby Swanson blasts one out. His second home run of the game, it's 9-7. And now it's Ronald Acuna Jr. Oh, this is deep to left center. Way back there, on its way, gone! He sends it out of here, and they boost their lead. It's 10-7. Tyler McGill, well struck right field. And it's gone! It's his sixth home run of the season, and they add to their lead. It's 11-7. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. J.D. Davis goes deep. His fourth home run of the season, and they're chipping away. It's 11-8. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. That one back. And gone. Francisco Lindor sent it out. And they add a couple more. It's 11-10. Hard looking right now. A little dicey. Kind of hieroglyphics style. Swing and this one's blasted. It's got a chance. Off the batter's eye and gone. A soaring shot to center. And we're all square. It's 11-11. Oh, now this one is blasted to right. Forget it. Way back there and gone. He'll circle the bases. Home run number five on the season. And the Mets jump in front. It's 12-11. Hitter waits. That one out to right. That's back there. Gone. He leaves the yard to right. That's career homer number 149. And we are all tied up. It's 12-12. Here's the catcher for the Mets, James McCann. 2-2 two -two now. Oh, and this one's blasted. High and deep. It's on its way. Out of here. Ball game. That should fire up the dugout, and the Mets walk it off for the win. And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. We've got open-air baseball for you on the show. It's the San Francisco Giants and the Milwaukee Brewers. That one ripped. That's back there. And that one is going to go. Brandon Crawford blasts one out. Third home run of the season. And just like that, they're out front. It's 1-0. 
Swung on, belted. That's back. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. Wilmer Flores provides the power. His fourth home run of the season. It's 2-0. That one hammered center field. That's back there. And that one's gone. This place is absolutely loving it. His second of the year, and they've got their first run. It's 2-1. Knopf and ripped it into the outfield. And now, Brandon Crawford. Drilled in the air, right field, way back there, and that is out of here. Brandon Crawford takes him deep, his second home run of the game, and they boost their lead. It's 4-1. From him a little bit, and he couldn't stay on the bag at first. Swing, and this is ripped down the right field line. Way back there, out of here. Jack Peterson bops one out. Home run number five on the season. It's 6-1. Hold them down. The offense has worked hard. It's shut down any time. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there, on its way, gone. Christian Yelich leaves the yard. His second of the year, and they cut into the lead. It's 6-2. Down, nobody on. Swing and a ball hammered, left field. That's back there. And it's out of here. He sends a rocket to left, and they slice into the lead. It's 6-3. Now a rocket to right center. Way back there. And forget it. It's out of here. Mike Yastrzemski leaves the yard. And they add a run. It's 7-3. Oh, yeah. The wind and the pitch. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Luis Arias goes deep. Third home run of the season, and they cut into the deficit. It's 7-4. And now this one's a rocket to right. Way back there. Gone. His first homer of the year, and they inch closer. It's 7-5. The 3-1. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there. On its way. Gone. A towering shot to right. And they tack one on the board. It's 8-5. Swing and that one hammered. Down the line. If it's fair, it's gone. And that is out of here. Andrew McCutcheon blasts one out. His second of the year, and they're chipping away. It's 8-7. Oh, Evan Longoria. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. Evan Longoria blasts one out. His fourth home run of the season. It's 10-7. Critch. This ball is hammered. Deep center field. Way back there. On its way. Out of here. And all of a sudden, for the hitter, that plate's... Oh, this is deep to left center. Way back there. On its way. Gone. NL West matchup on the show. It's the Arizona Diamondbacks taking on the Los Angeles Dodgers. And with two strikes, you just struggle to put the ball in play. You don't even have to get a hit. Oh, this ball is crushed into left field. It's on its way and gone. Mookie Betts blasts one out, and that gives him a lead. It's 1-0. As a pitcher, it really allows you to start expanding the zone. Guys become def this one swung on and hit well. Way back there. And that ball is gone. He blasts one out to center. His second of the year. And we're all square. It's tied at one. 
to understand how he flowed nicely into the skipper's chair. That one is absolutely belted. And it's gone. Trey Turner goes deep. Third home run of the season. And they jump out front. It's 2-1. Well, that one went up. Hit well. Right field way back and gone. Ready, Freeman bops one out of here. Home run number five on the season, and they add a run. It's 3-1. Left-hand batter waits. Yeah, this one's well hit. Way back there. On its way and out of here. Grand slam. He'll touch them all. His fourth home run of the season. It's 7-1. That was blasted. Absolutely. No doubt off the bat. Let's break out the stat cast numbers. It's singing. It tells us this home run was projected at more than 450 feet. Yeah. On this guy. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there. On its way. Gone. He made him pay for that one. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. It's 10-1. 3-2 now. Oh, now this one is blasted to right. Forget it. Way back there and gone. Max Muncy leaves the yard. Third home run of the season, and they tack one on the board. It's 11-1. Pitch. Hit well. Right field way back and gone. Cody Bellinger blasts one out. His fourth home run of the season. It's 12-1 at the belt and fires. That one ripped right center field on its way. And that ball is out of here. A solo shot. And they add to the lead. It's 13-1. Right-handed reliever. He swings and drives one out to deep left field. That one back there. And it's out of here. So he just clears the wall. His ninth homer of the year. It's 14-1. But why the kick the pitch? That one hammered center field on its way. Gone. He sends it out of here. And they close the gap. It's 14-2. Well struck left field. That one on its way. Gone! Justin Turner takes in deep, and they add to their lead. It's 15-2. The wind and the pitch. And that one hammered back there. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. So he leaves the yard to left, and they add on. It's 16 to 2. Pitch. That one ripped left field. This one's got a chance. And forget it. Chris Taylor blasts one out. Home run number five on the season. It's 18 to 2. The pitch. Swings and crushes one. Right field, way back, and gone. A two-run shot, and they add a couple more. It's 18 to 6. Hello and welcome to Oakland. We're at Ring Central Coliseum. MLB the show with a good one coming at you. It's the Detroit Tigers going up against the Oakland Athletics. Every outing or every season. But last year, he gave his team an opportunity. That one drilled left field. It's gone! He'll circle the bases. The Athletics score first. It's 1-0. Work hard to generate base runners. And when you've got a strike thrower like this...
Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. His fourth home run of the season, and they add a run. It's 2 nothing. His highest gear and go a long way to track that one down. Nothing better than that. You feel like a wide receiver playing football. Way back there. And that one is out of here. Jonathan Scope takes him deep. It's his sixth home run of the season. It's 2-1. Swing and that one hammered. Down the line. If it's fair, it's gone. And that is out of here. He circles the bases, his second of the year, and they tack on to their lead. It's 3-1. And a 1-2 again. That one blasted deep to right. That's back. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. The Rockets won to right, his second of the year, and they boost their lead. It's 4-1. The pitch. Swings and blasts one deep to left center. And that is gone. An absolute blast to left. His second of the year. It's 7-1. Here's Christian Pache. Now a rocket to right center. Way back there. And forget it. It's out of here. So he goes the opposite way with that one. And they throw a pair on the board. It's 9-1. He swings and drives one out to deep left field. Gone! His fourth home run of the season, and they add to their lead. It's 10-1. Swing and a high fly ball, pretty well struck right field. That one's deep. Gone! That'll fire up the dugout. It's his sixth home run of the season. It's 10-3 this game drilled the left center way back there and that is gone that was a moonshot his second home run of the game and they add a run it's 11-3 just love interacting yeah. with the people it's just fun oh, to connect man. I mean as I was headed up to the booth one guy shouted at me make sure to say hi to Kenny and out of here that one felt good. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. It's 13-3. Now for the Tigers. And there's a fly ball deep right field. That ball's carrying. Turning, looking, and that one is gone. A towering shot to right. And they inch closer. It's 13-5. That is kind of velocity so critical that you move the ball around, work quick. Oh, now this one's high and deep. Way back there. On its way. Gone. Definitely score it. This one drilled to left. No doubt about it as they add on more. Gone. He'll touch them all, and they add a pair. It's 15-6. He absolutely off as well. And now it's going to be Christian Pache. Swing and a ball hammered left field. That one back. Out of here! Third home run of the season, and they add on. It's 16-6. to six. Go to work with Swing and a ball lifted in the air, left field, pretty well struck. That one's back there, and it's gone! A shot to left, and they slice into the lead. It's 16 to 11. An AOS matchup on the show. It's the Los Angeles Angels taking on the Seattle Mariners. A lot of momentum when he's on the mound. Now here is JP Crawford. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. Out of here. Third home run of the season, and it gives him the lead in the first. It's 1-0. Already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. That one is absolutely belted. And it is gone. Third home run of the season.
the season, and they add to the lead. It's 2 0. Now, this one is hammered way back there on its way and gone, and we are tied. He sends a rocket to left, and we are starting over. It's 2 2. In the zone, you usually see a swing and miss or a weak contact in the infield. Now a blast to left center, way back there, on its way, out of here. He flexes his power with that swing, home run number five on the season, and just like that, they're out front. It's 4-2. Well, that one comes a 2-2. Oh, now this is drilled to center, way back there, on its way, and gone. Taylor Ward blasts one out. His fourth home run of the season. It's 5-2. Two. two and one now. There's a swing and a drive. Way back there. And that one is going to go. He sends it out of here. His fourth home run of the season. And they add a run. It's 6-2. It's a 1-1. One, one. That one ripped left field. And go! Another homer. It's his sixth home run of the season, and they boost their lead. It's 8 2. Much of the at bat. Oh, and now this one's crushed. This one's on its way, and gone. Jared Walsh blasts one out. It's his eighth home run of the year. It's 9 2. The bases, like he did right there. Here's Anthony Rendon up to the plate. Oh, this ball is crushed into left field. It's on its way and gone. Third home run of the season, and they tack on to their lead. It's 10-2. to The wind and the pitch. Oh, this is deep to left center. Way back there. On its way and gone. Another one. Back-to-back -back homers. His first homer of the year, and they add to their lead. It's 11-2. To, to the plate now. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. Eugenio Suarez blasts one out, and they close the gap. It's 11-4. Well struck right field. And out of here. He powers one out to right field. His ninth homer of the year. It's 13-4. Oh, now this one's blasted deep to left. Way back there. On its way and out of here. He made him pay for that one. His second of the year. And they throw a pair on the board. It's 15-4. Well, at the very least, put a great swing on it. Matt. Oh, now this is blasted. Way back there, on its way, gone. The two-run shot, his second home run of the game, and they cut into the deficit. It's 15-6. Henniger. Now a blast to left center, way back there, on its way, out of here. Mitch Hanniger leaves the yard. Home run number five on the season, and they're chipping away. It's 15-7. Swings here and blasts one left field. That's back there. And out of here. His fourth home run of the season, and they tack on three. It's 18-7. Here's Upton, swing and a drive. That one lifted deep to left. Way back there, and that one's gone. He's done it again. His second homer of the game, and they tack one on the board. It's 19 to seven. Welcome everyone. Let's jump right in and revisit the news and events from Monday. In the AL Central, Gio Urshela plated four total with three home runs as the Twins downed the Guardians 13-7. The White Sox knocked out 12 hits as a team as they beat the Royals in Kauffman Stadium 14-10.
Elvis Andrews, was a force at the plate with three long balls and four RBIs. As the Athletics took care of the Tigers, 16 to 11. Brandon Lau had a day to remember with three home runs totaling five RBIs as Tampa Bay rolled past the Blue Jays 17 to 11. Ryan Mountcastle drove in an impressive five with two home runs as the Orioles took down the Red Sox 17 to nine. The Houston Astros got 18 hits as they defeated the visiting Yankees 11 to nine. Mike Trout launched a pair of home runs while driving in four along the way as the Angels got the win against the Mariners, 19-8. The Miami Marlins had 12 hits as a team as they were winners over the visiting Rangers, 8-6. The New York Mets put up 16 hits on the day as they took down the visiting Braves, 16-12. The Philadelphia Phillies got 11 hits overall as they took down the Nationals in Washington, 8-6. Andrelton Simmons was a major force at the plate with six RBIs as the Cubs took down the rival cards, 14-10. O'Neill Cruz plated four total with three home runs as the Buccos took down the Reds, 13-10. The Giants launched seven home runs in this one as they took a victory against the Brewers in Milwaukee, 10-9. The Dodgers got 18 hits as they took down the visiting Diamondbacks, 18 to six. As always, thanks for tuning in. That's all we've got this morning. Enjoy the games later today and we'll see you tomorrow.